earlier this afternoon, there was crime scene tape everywhere. A lot of cars had bullet holes in them. Police say at least 12 to 15 shots were fired. Even State Road 436 had to be shut down for hours. Now, it was a miracle. No one else was killed or even injured. Crime scene tape surrounded the body of Tevin Demetrius Davis. He was only 22 years old. Officers arrived on scene to find a deceased black male laying in the westbound lanes of State Road 436. State Road 436 had to be shut down for hours while the medical examiner removed the body. Police say this was no random act of violence. Investigators say Davis was targeted by two 19-year-old twin brothers, Christopher and Manuel Rodriguez. It's scary. It's just, it's just really scary. And and, you know, we have kids that, you know, they go around here. I'm the shooting happened around 1.30 Monday afternoon, right in front of this Best Buy on State Road 436. Police say the two brothers opened fire as if it was a gun range. You can see the evidence everywhere, bullet holes in this stop sign and in cars in the Best Buy parking lot. Multiple gunshots were fired. Thanks to witnesses, police spotted the suspect's tan Chevrolet car in Longwood. Our officers, along with the Seminole County Sheriff's Office and the assistance of the Longwood Police Department, spotted the vehicle on 434. A short pursuit engaged and right in front of South Seminole Hospital, both suspects were taken into custody. Investigators say they found guns, money and drugs inside the brother's trunk. Officers don't know the exact reason behind the shooting, but neighbors are shocked. It's just ridiculous. People mm -hmm. just use weapons instead of, you know, talking it out or even fist fighting for crying out loud. The Rodriguez brothers were charged with first degree premeditated murder. They were booked earlier today at the Seminole County Jail. Reporting live in Altamont Springs, Jackie Orozco, Fox 35 News. Jackie,